Hello, hello there again, uh, Star Wars The Clone Wars action figure fans, Star Wars The Clone Wars The Show fans. Um, this is a uh, Star Wars The Clone Wars character encyclopedia review, and this is a book. Some of you have probably seen this book before. It's done by DK, uh, and this book um, is awesome. And uh, I actually bought this book at my school's book fair uh, because I uh, actually had seen uh, one of my buddies, uh, uh, his name is Phil West, he's known on Flickr as Beast from the East, had posted this, and I guess they got it up there in Canada, which is where he lives, well before us, or I just didn't see it, one or the other, I'm not sure, but <coughs> this book is really cool. And um, I want to I want to show you some of this, just how cool this book is. Um, if you it's a character encyclopedia, so it's alphabetical, and it has a little um, description of the name of the character. Kind of doesn't tell you what episode they were in, but it tells you what they did in in the episode they were in. Really great high resolution photo of them, kind of like some things telling you a little bit about them or features of their helmet. There's some stats and then there's a shot from whatever episode they were in. Here's the firefighter clone. I mean uh, uh, droid. Firefighter droid. What's great about this book is that it's got really great photos and just you know some good reading but it's not you know it's just informational more than anything. There's Poggle the Lesser. Uh, in this book, I use it. I mostly bought it because I wanted to use it for my customs work or whatever work that I, you know, that I was doing. And I'll show you the page that I've used the most in the in the last couple of months since I got it. I think I got it back in October. And that there's a zombie Geonosian, yeah, Vulture Droid. Page that I've been using quite the most. My favorite clone is Waxer. There he is. And probably my second favorite clone is Commander Wolf. And what's great about this is, prior to having this book, I could not find any really good images of Commander Wolf and his armor. And this is just a great, great... I did end up finding a couple of really good um, graphic designs that they actually from um, uh, Lucasworks or from the Clone Wars series of, of uh, Commander Wolf that gave me a good shot of the back of him. But prior to that, I didn't see anything. And so this has got a really great... There's a good picture of his cybernetic eye. Really great photo of him. And lots of other things, too. I'll tell you another. Here's Embo. There he is. And on the facing page is Commander Phil. And I did actually use this photo when I was working on good old Commander Phil as a reference for my custom figure. As you can see, and he's kind of falling forward right there. I did a video on him a couple days ago. Um, let's see. Flamethrower clone. Uh, I believe Commander Jet is in here. He's another one of my favorite clones. Let's see. Here would be... There's Jack. And there's... Oh, another cool character is Jabo Hood. And... Jester. I believe he's from um, the uh, Jester is from the Hidden Enemy episode, I believe, or he might be from the um, Evil Within episode, the one where they the, the worms get into Barasafi and Ahsoka has to face off. He might be from that one. I, I'm not sure. It's been a while since I've seen. But here's uh, Jet. Really looking forward to a figure of him coming out. Uh, of course, they've got Jedi in here and bounty hunters. They do not have Boba Fett in here. That is the one 
um, downfall of this book, but it also leads me to there's C-3PO and Cad Bane. It's the one thing, however, there's Bosk, very cool picture of Bosk, and yes, they do have Arsing. Oh, here's another really cool clone. There's Boost, and uh, Bola Rapal, Jedi. There's Bly, clone marshal commander of the 327th Star Corps. And there's Boyle, another really cool clone. Best buds with Waxer, of course. Um, clone or droid commander. There's Barris, and of course there is Senator Organa, and there she is. Ara Singh, one of my absolute favorite bounty hunter characters, and I actually did take my Ara Singh and, and uh, uh, removed her plastic antenna and put a. a sewing needle into her and cut it off so it actually looked like her actual there's a nice good shot of her love Ara Singh she's awesome I actually want to get another Ara Singh figure and paint her black with the black around her eyes like she is in that uh, episode where she tries to assassinate Padme there's a senate commander that's actually our geese right there and there's Ventress I still gotta get a figure of her and there is an ARF, otherwise known as Advanced Recon Force Trooper, on an ATRT. There she is. There's Ahsoka. And Amit Noloff, another senator. Ayla Sakura, got to get a figure of her. Her figure actually uh, goes for around uh, $60 on eBay. So, um, I did see, though, that there is a new sculpt that's supposed to be coming out for her, and I hope Hasbro, Hasbro does uh, end up uh, releasing her, because I really do want a um, Ayla Sakura Clone Wars. And there is a vintage collection figure of her coming out this year, which I hope to get as well. Um, oh, there's Pre Vizsla. Pretty good uh, image of him. There's his Dark Saber. And there is a, there's Plo Koon, Dave Filoni's uh, favorite Jedi. And I do believe there's Padme. Love that Padme figure. And there's Ord Innocence, Jedi Holocron trilogy episodes. Uncle Anno, Oddball. I'm trying to find the Mandalorian. New Gunray was there. Nadar. Mon Mothma. I'm hoping that they make a figure of her. She's been in a couple episodes now. Matchstick. There he is. Mandalorian. Warrior. Really cool photo of, of a Mandalorian warrior. I wish they had included a photo. There's a really great shot from the second in the Mandalorian trilogy from season two where you can see just hundreds and hundreds of Mandalorian warriors, Death Watch warriors behind him previous as he's talking to Can't Do Count Dooku via hologram. Uh, there's Luminara and Mace. Don't have Luminara yet, I need to get her. But anyhow, you get the basic idea. So if you are a Star Wars the Clone Wars fan you want to have this book and you can also get it in hardback and I saw the hardback copy in Barnes and Noble the other day thought about picking picking it up I think it was only like 15 bucks the softback is about ten dollars I think yeah 9.99 that's how much I paid for it and also if you want to fill the, the holes in your collection like for instance Commander Wolf or Commander Phil this is a great resource to use for you. So anyhow, that'll do it for this review of the Star Wars The Clone Wars Character Encyclopedia. Until next time, may the Force be with you. Bye.